Hi everyone, Stacy Burke here, and it's a gloomy day at the beach. It's been rainy, McRainy. I cleaned the house a little bit. I cleaned the bird cage. I could only clean the house so much because when it rains, it kind of makes the house more messy. If that makes sense. So I could only clean so much because when the rain ends, that's when I really clean. Because when I come in and out of the rain, you know you. Things get trucked in through the house. Um, the blankets on the balcony I need to wash. I need to clean the balcony. You know, just so I'm waiting for the rain to end so I can really clean the house. Uh, but yeah, it's just a cold day, so I've been doing a lot of things around the house. I got Katie right here next to me, which is an odd thing because like, okay, her name is Katie because I've always loved the name Katie. I've always wanted a little girl named Katie. Now, I don't have any children. I am barren. I can't have any children. My health issues. I have the links down below. I'll try to find uh, the videos about why I can't have children and everything about that. Um, I did a few videos about that. Um, in fact, I was even married and my husband had an issue with that. He said he did it, but later on he did. I found out a lot of men do have issues with that for some reason. Um, that's that's a, that's a, what do you call it? Not a game changer, but it's just um, a deal breaker. And I did a video a long time ago where, well, actually, it started with Trisha Paytas a long time ago, got a baby doll and called it Baby OJ. And, um, I thought that was funny. And so um, I found the same doll. And this is when I was married and I was, um, we were out Christmas shopping for this little boy that my, my, that we were like, cause my husband at work, he would draw, um, like a secret Santa and they would give gifts to the unfortunate. Come on, Felix. Felix is being grumpy. My, my cat, because he's been wanting treats all day and I've been giving him treats, but I can't give him treats all the time. So he's grumpy because I stopped giving him treats, so he's kind of walking around trying to get my attention. But anyway, we were at the, uh, I, think it was a tar I think it was a Target or Walmart, and I found the same baby doll. And I've always wanted like, a real life type baby doll to be as my baby, you know, just for fun. Like, out of all the people to be sensitive about it, it should be me because I'm the one that can't have a child. But for some reason, he got really upset when I found her. And it's oddly enough, her name, I, I named her Katie because it was before this one. You hear the noise. That's Felix going outside the doggy door and eating his dry food. Because I'm not giving him any wet, uh, any of his um, treats. So he's pouting. So he's going out in the rain and going on the balcony and eating his dry food. A little pouty pouty. But anyway, I found this baby doll. And I named her Baby Katie. Well now I can't. I gotta think I gotta think of a different name for her. I was gonna now that I'm with uh, Mike Timpson, I was gonna call her Mike Timpson Jr. <laughs> Tammy Timpson. <laughs> Which is the reason for this video. When I got got her, my husband was so angry angry where it was almost comical and i'm like i'm not trying to mock you or make fun of you i want to buy her because i've always wanted a baby doll and it kind of like like when you're a little girl you have one i used to love having one as a little girl and like that was my baby doll i put her in a buggy it was fun and it's great because you don't get the real parenting thing like she doesn't scream she doesn't cry she's not going to cost me lots of money She's not going to go to jail. She's like, you know what I mean? Like, she's not going to get older. Uh, you know, I don't have to get a babysitter. It's a perfect baby. And, um, and she's very lifelike. Like, look, she's very lifelike. You know? Had her for a long time. And, um, and, and I just, I would laugh because I just didn't understand the hate he had towards her. And, and just, he would get mad at me and not talk to me. Go like, what are you doing? Mocking, mocking our situation. I'm like, well, you, you knew my situation before we got married. 
like it wasn't like this is a new thing i'm like anyway i just didn't get it i just didn't understand it but i left it alone i put her away in my bedroom and I, you know whatever and now i'm, I'm dating mike Timson, of course and he doesn't have kids never wanted neither do i so we're totally on board and plus i can't have them anyway so it's like it's not even a discussion but either way i wouldn't want any anyway but so I joke around and I bring her around and he won't even like pretend and hold her. He just takes the doll and he'll throw it and he gets really kind of annoyed. He jokes around kind of, but it's one of those jokings where it's not really joking. He really doesn't want to deal with this at all. He, he, he will literally just throw her and like not even, not even, not even like when we try to do skits. Or we're on the Zoom uh, with the Gary and Dino show, or just kind of just a, just a comical bit. Not on board, almost to the degree of my husband, which I thought I got to do a video about this because maybe I could get the guy's perspective or maybe a girl's. I just don't understand the anger. It's not like I'm trying to like, ooh, I want a baby because I don't. I, you know, I just think she does look like a little baby doll, and it kind of gives me the feelings of when I was a kid, and I used to have a baby doll, and this is kind of fun, and I figured it would be good in skits, or um, or a bit, you know, like some kind of comical bit, or some kind of, like, video, or photos, or I don't know, because you know me, I have lots of costumes, lots of props, and I could do stuff. And, you know, and she, I could change her. She could be a, a boy. I could probably get some onesies. I, I could probably get some cool punk rock um, baby clothes and dress her up and just kind of, I don't know. My husband would say, oh, this is unhealthy. I go, what? I'm like, I'm like, I don't do this daily. Like, I'll bring her out maybe once every, I know, year or, or maybe twice a year. Like, you know, is that a big deal? But I do have her in my bedroom, you know, as part of the decoration. She's in my bedroom. And I'm thinking, God, you know, maybe I will buy some baby clothes, you know, although I really need to pay rent. I have more, I have different priorities. But if I could afford it, I probably would put her in, like, punk rock clothes and, you know, kind of, she'd be more prominent. And, and I probably would bring her out for videos and stuff like that. Because I think she's cute. She even has Timson's eyes. <laughs> But I don't know. I just thought it was odd. I wouldn't think of all the people he would be like so like. He even makes a face like, and he's he's joking, but it's not. It's not as um violent as my husband. My husband was like he was this like scary, violent, and and mean about it. Where um, Zenzen just like. He would literally just throw it. I go, please don't throw it. Please don't break her. Please don't like you know, like respect my property or my baby. <laughs> like don't you know, don't don't injure it. I mean, I I like this. It's like anything. Like don't throw my coffee cup. Don't throw you know, like just have respect. But um, yeah, I gotta calm myself down around around him with her. But that's why I just did a video. Like maybe you could give me some insight. Because my husband, I, I got it. Like, he always wanted children, and he was angry at me that I couldn't give him one. Like, he was, he really was angry at me. There's a whole video I think I've done about it where he really had anger towards it, which I don't get. It's not like I could do anything about it. Um, but, um, and we couldn't adopt anyway. We didn't have the money. And plus, we were fighting. I didn't want to bring a kid involved in that. Um, we didn't have enough money for that. He had um, health issues. It, so to adopt is much harder than just to have a baby yourself. So I, that wasn't even my fault either. We just couldn't. We couldn't adopt. Um, but now that my boyfriend Timson's kind of having the same reaction, I'm like, okay, there's is there more to it than I than is there more to it? I is what is it? What's the deal? I mean, I get it if I could have children, if I was if I was younger and if, if I didn't have medical problems and he'd be upset thinking like, oh, she's trying to like get me to 
like want to have children or something and, I, and I'm not so I'm like I just I just don't get it I just don't get it like I go just just hold her just hold her like and nope he's just like you will not have anything to do with her and I mean I find it hilarious but yet it is kind of hurtful because it's like you know she's my baby <laughs> It's like if he was, if he didn't like cats, although he loves cats, it's wonderful. But I mean, if it would be, it's almost, to me, it's almost the same thing. Like if I was dating someone, I just found out they don't like cats. Well, I'm like, well, that's kind of a deal breaker. I'm not saying it's a deal breaker that you don't like my baby doll, but kind of, kind of, because it, it's kind of like a red flag, right? It's a little, it's a little bit of a red flag. Like, what's the deal? What is the deal? Unless there's some kind of, history that i don't know about same with my husband there could, there could be something that's triggering and um maybe in different ways um but so far they haven't really said anything about what the trigger is just you know my husband i, I think i know but my boyfriend i have no idea what the trigger would be no, I, you know, I stopped bringing her out, but it's kind of sad because I can't enjoy her. I like to enjoy her once in a while. I like the way she feels in my arms. Oops, I don't like how the hat keeps falling off, though. I don't like how the hat keeps falling off. Um, I mean, I'm not really keen about the outfit. I like that she comes with a little pacifier. Keep her quiet. <laughs> but she just fits really good, and she's forever a baby. Look at her little feet. Her little feet are really cool. Her little toes, you know. She has pin marks on her because I, I don't know why. I forget. I think she was next to my pins and so she has some pin marks on her. What are you doing, girly girl? So, oh, she could also suck her thumb, I think. I think she can. Oh, yeah, she could suck her thumb. There we go. She could suck her thumb. Oh, that's cool. I like that. She does. She feels good in the arms and stuff like that. So it kind of, it kind of, you know, it kind of like uh, suppresses or uh, pacifies a little bit of my maternal instincts. But not really. I got my cats, you know, I got my animals, I got my birds, you know, I got my boyfriend, you know, I have the caregiver inside of me. Plenty fulfilled. Plenty fulfilled. Lots, lots, you know, lots of work there with with all what I got going on. So caretaker, check. You know, I'm I'm good with that. But it's it's still kind of fun. I like to have her around. So um I don't know. Put in the comments what do you think it is? Like I try to ask him and he just like he just and I, I don't even know if it's anything. He just doesn't want to like nope. I don't want any part like when he doesn't want kids, he doesn't want kids, even if it's this <laughs> even if it's it's stuffed, you know like um like like fake like like a baby doll like not even so i guess that could be it i don't know i don't know oh i wonder if she could suck her toe you suck your toe because this toes can you suck your toe no that doesn't fit but babies do suck their own toes but anyway i kind of I, I was gonna um instead of katie since i got the cat katie <laughs> my new name for her is Tammy Timpson. <laughs> so meet Tammy Timpson. Meet the Timpsons. Tammy Timpson. Look, she even dances. She's so cute. I like playing with her. I think it's just it's just fun, you know? Yeah, I'm a grown adult plays with toys. Yeah. So and uh yeah. So anyway, that's nothing much to the story. That's just basically it. Um, but I'm still going to have fun with her. I'm still going to bring her out on certain videos and maybe have a skit. I think I did a Krampus skit. Because Krampus, if you know the, the history of Krampus, what he does is with naughty children, he takes them away, you know, or gives them coal or, you know, puts them in his knapsack. So I played a Krampus. Well, Krampus, Elvis Krampus. Um, Cramp this, and I did a skit with her, if you, you see that video. So I bring her on videos and stuff, and I use her in, as a prop. And I, I love 
uh, Tammy Timpson. <laughs> Which it could be Mike Jr. I could I could make it a boy. I could change the hat and everything, and I could do Mike Timpson Jr. <laughs> But she's already a girl, so I'm going to call her, um, so the Timpson name is not going to um, <laughs> continue. <laughs> There's no spreading the seed. Um, it, it's it's just going to be Tammy Timpson. So um, say hi to Tammy Timpson. <laughs> We're having a name name change. She, she identifies as Tammy Timpson. Uh, no longer Katie since Katie, where I got uh, Princess Katie there. So I just want to introduce you to um, Tammy Timpson, and uh, she's going to be a baby forever. She'll forever be my baby, won't you? We just got to get you new clothes. Get you new baby clothes. Rocky, she's not that heavy either. She's a good baby. She takes after her mom. <laughs> He's going to hate me for this video. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Daddy, Daddy, why don't you love me? Daddy, Daddy. Oh, there you go, talk. Daddy, Daddy, please love me. Please love me. I'm a good girl, I am. I'm a good girl, I am. I'm Tammy Timpson. And I can sing songs. <laughs> Well, stay tuned for more video of me and Tammy Timpson. I think this, this, I think we're gonna do more videos together, Tammy. What do you think? You think so? Let's make you a YouTube star. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, Google like when our Trisha Paytas had a baby OJ, and she had this baby doll, and it just like I was like, oh, I want a baby doll, and I went out and got one. I got Tammy Timpson, forever baby. It's okay. Daddy will come around sometime. Although he did go out for a pack of cigarettes. He's been gone a long time. <laughs> oh, well. College isn't cheap. We're going to have to have a little talk. <laughs> we don't want you on that stripper pole. we got to get you an education, Tabby. <laughs> I better stop. I better stop. But I just want to uh, reintroduce my baby girl, Tammy. <laughs> so there you go. You'll see more of her. So um, let's just hope her, her daddy comes around and he loves her. <laughs> After all, she does have his eyes, right? <laughs> all right, I better stop. Okay, that's it for this video. That's all I have to say in this one. To all my stay skidettes and all my briquettes, I hope you have a groovy day. Until next time, peace. Easy. Easy. Peace. Peace. Bye. <laughs> have a groovy day. Peace.